Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please, if this is your first time viewing, consider to subscribe to this channel. Turn on the like setting video, you notice fine. Let's solve this question together. Now look at what you are given. We are given that 3 is pi index of s equals to what 3 raised to power 27. We are asked to find the value of s. Now, most students, okay, most students make serious mistake about this. Note that there's a big difference between what? 3 titration what s is equal to what 3 raised to the power of x. There's a big, big difference between this. As you are seeing this, the exponent is this place you are seeing. It's not exponential, it's what? Titration. And titration simply means when a number is raised to the power of itself, say vary. Okay? Titration simply means when a number is raised to the power of itself, say vary. Okay? Now, if I'm having 3 titration x is equal to 3 raised to the power of x, they are not the same. So this will not be equal to this. Okay? Now, if I have 2 titration, x titration 2 is equal to x to the power of what x. Okay? It simply means that when a number is raised to the power of itself, say vary. If I have x titration 3 is equal to what x to the power of x to the power of what x. Okay? Now, let's consider this question on the board. Now, for us to solve this problem, I have to convert 3 raised to the power 27 to titration form. If you cannot convert it to titration form, you cannot solve this problem. Because I observe that most of them, when see question like this, they say since the basis are the same, they equal the index. That is not index. That is what? Titration. Also, I wonder why titration was not taught in our what? Grade 12, grade 10, and even in our high institution, titration was not taught. I wonder why. But checking my work, I observe that titration was not among any what? Any secondary school or any grade 12 level what? Say, uh, curriculum, curriculum, okay? Titration was not found, okay? Now, to solve this problem under titration, we have to do what? We have to convert this 3 raised to power 27 to titration form. So, I want you to understand that, that 3 titration 2 simply means 3 raised to the power of what? 3. So, if I have 3 raised to the power of 3, and 3 raised to the power of 3 simply means what? 3 times 3 into 3 places, okay? And again, and I'm having 27 here, okay? So, this now, you can see that I'm having 3 titration 2, which is equal to 3, two, three raised to the power of 3. Okay, and 3 support 3 simply means what? 20 what? 7. Is it not good for me to write 3 support 3 in place of this? Okay, is it not good? It's good. But also, it, you cannot still solve it because it's the same thing. So what are we going to do? What if we have what? 3 titration 3. 3 titration 3 simply means 3 raised to the power of 3 raised to the power of what? 3. Now, I'm okay. If I write 3 titration 3, simply means 3 raised to the power of 3 raised to the power of 3. Because 3 raised to the power of 3 you are seeing here represent what? 27 as you can see from here. 27 and we are seeing the exponent here 27 so you can write that 3 titration s is equal to what 3 titration what 3 okay because 3 titration 3 simply means 3 to the power what 27 can you see how simple it is very simple and interesting i want you to understand that titration simply means when a number is raised to the power of itself say very okay can you see how simple and interesting it is i wonder why this was not taught in our grade 12 in our grade 11. I wonder why. In our, in our high institution, in our high institution, this was not taught. Okay? So learn this because it's very helpful. Okay? Now, from here, we can equate the SPAPA index because since the basis are the same, let's equate the SPAPA index. Okay? Because this is SPAPA index. You cannot call it index because it's different from index, right? Let's equate the SPAPA is SPAPA what index. So we can equate this, equate the basis since the SPAPA index. Let's equate the SPAPA index since the basis are the same. So we see that our s is equal to what? 3. This is just the solution to this problem. Can you see how simple and interesting? Very, very simple and interesting. So note that titration simply means when a number is raised to the power of itself, say very. But note that this titration I'm talking about was not taught in any level of education. Yes, was not taught in any level of education. Even in high institution, it was not taught. So how come we know about titration? Titration is one of the among your problem we have in mathematics but i didn't know it was not in any aspect of mathematics okay so titration is a problem itself on itself we have to approach the knowledge of mathematics before you can solve titration and know that titration if you know the, the meaning of titration that means you can stop titration because i said that titration simply means when a number is raised to the power of itself savory so i'm praying that this this titration of it should be among the school curriculum so that students will learn about what titration is not simple interesting it's like when you're solving exponential you know about what titration 
it's very simple okay so thank you so much for watching please if you find it very interesting don't hesitate do well to like comment and share with the long ones or others who learn about this titration we are talking about so thank you so much and god bless you and again if you're not subscribed to this channel consider to subscribe after watching so that anytime although there are excessive videos like this you also will notify so thank you so much and god bless you